Hey guys, Sarah here. Welcome back to the channel. I hope you guys are all doing amazing. Today I have a Dollar Tree DIY. We're going to be making our own Dollar Tree version of a Lush Sugar Scrub. These are perfect for the winter crusty lips. You can even use it on your body. Everything is from the Dollar Tree. It's a lot of natural ingredients and it doesn't cost a lot of money to make. So I'm super excited to share it with you guys. If you guys like this video or you like my channel, go ahead and subscribe. I would love to have you. We are trying to reach 90k so if you could help me out, it would mean the world to me if you're already subscribed thank you girl so if you guys want to see how i made these really adorable sugar scrubs out of everything from the dollar tree just keep on watching so here's what you're going to need you're going to need some white sugar some dollar tree coconut oil a little bit of vitamin e oil this is optional and then these freeze-dried strawberries which are in like the snack section I'm also going to be using one bar of coconut oil and sea salt soap, but you could use any bar soap. Some lemon extract, and this is in like the baking spicing spices section. And then this is a silicone heart mold that's from uh, Walmart. It was $3.50. You don't need it, but it makes it look really cute. And if you're not going to use the mold, some storage containers. So taking a blender or food processor, you're going to add in your freeze-dried strawberries. They look like real strawberries, but they need to be like made into a powder. So we're just going to add them in and we're going to pulverize them and chop them up until it's like a powdery mixture. Strawberry is great for the skin because it's rich in vitamin C. Also, the fruit acid in it is really great for the lips because it will help plump them up and liven them up if they're looking dry and crusty. So I took about half of the bar of soap and I kind of chopped it up and we're going to do the same thing. We're going to put it into the blender and we're going to blend it down so that it becomes almost like a fine powder. You don't have to use the soap, but the soap is what's going to bind everything together. So now we're going to move on. We have our strawberry and our soap in separate bowls. We're going to take some of our coconut oil. I took about one fourth of a cup of it, like a good amount. You want to really eye it. I didn't follow too many like measurements or anything like that. I just, I just eyed it. Um, but I'm going to add that into our soap mixture and we're going to mix it up. We're also going to put it into the microwave for 15 second increments because we're going to want to melt the soap all the way down. So I'm just stirring it. I'll put it in the microwave, stir it again. And we're going to do this until everything is completely melted. Once the soap is nicely melted, we're going to add in some of the vitamin E oil. This is just going to help to preserve the lip scrub. And then you're also going to add in a few drops of the lemon extract. And this is going to give it a nice smell. So now in a separate bowl, we're going to add in our strawberries. We're next going to be adding in our sugar. And the sugar is what's going to actually exfoliate the skin, get all of the dead skin cells off of your lips. So I added in about one and a half to two cups. I really just eyed it and you can add in more as you go. Now we're going to do a similar scrub that's going to be completely white and we can layer it on top. So I took about a cup of sugar and a cup of the lavender Epsom salt. I added in a few drops of the lemon extract and then we're also going to be adding in some of the vitamin E oil and coconut oil. I added in about a fourth of a cup of the coconut oil but again just eye it. You're going to mix it all up. If it needs to be a little bit more liquidy you can add in some more of the vitamin E oil or you can add in more sugar if it's too wet. So just mix it and play around with it and you can eye it and this is going to give us the ability to layer it pink and white pink and white but you don't have to do this if you don't want to i just thought it'd be super cute for valentine's day the dollar tree has a lot of great containers that you can use for this one i'm going to be using this larger plastic container and this is going to allow me to give more of it away so i'm just going to be using a layer of the white and then a layer of the pink and i'm going to alternate that going up as much as i can to fill it all the way up for the red hearts all i did is i just took our red scrub i added it into the heart mold i put it in the freezer for about 30 minutes i allowed it to get hard and then I took it out and you're seeing me here popping them out. 
So they turn into like a complete heart once you let it harden. And then you can use this to scrub your body, which is so much better than having to stick your hand into a container. So even if you just have like square ones, using a mold is so much better, especially with scrubs. But these look really, really cute and you can package them up nicely. You can put them in some like clear plastic wrap or something to make them look cute. But I just think they look super adorable and they're the perfect gift for Valentine's Day. This Dollar Tree scrub is bomb.com. I want you guys all to try it out. It will have your lips feeling super soft. I like to use it on my hands, my elbows, my knees. I don't recommend using it on your face, but you could if you don't have sensitive skin. If you guys try it out, let me know. You can find me on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. Subscribe to my channel if you guys want more Dollar Tree $1 videos. I'm all about that life here and I would love to have you. I love you guys so much. I cannot wait to see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.